Welcome. In front of me is a Realme 8 Pro and today I'll show you how to transfer files from one location to another. So I'm going to be transferring them from the phone to an SD card, but you can basically reverse it and transfer it from, well, the other way around. So to get started, you will want to open up the files app, which will be located in the Google folder. From here, scroll down and you will find the two different storages at the bottom. So we have the internal, which is the storage of the phone and then SD card. Now, I'm gonna start with the internal storage because that's where I think my files are. And uh, as you can see, there's a bunch of folders in here, but let's be honest, most of them are not important. They contain nothing. Uh, so I'm just gonna mention the two or three different folders that will probably contain something. So number one will be the DCIM folder, which contains pictures, uh, videos, and in this case, screenshots. So you can see screenshots and camera. Um, then if we go back, we have the downloads folder, which will contain anything downloaded. As you can see uh, in here, I have an application and an image. Uh, if you download images, they don't get saved to DCIM. They need to be captured with the device to be saved there. Um, so anything downloaded, saved will go into here, into the download folder. And I was gonna say that there is also a pictures folder, but we already seen that screenshots get saved to DCIM instead of uh, the pictures folder. So that would basically finish it up. So we have downloads and DCIM that are uh, most likely gonna have something. The rest of them primarily empty, assuming you don't have some kind of dedicated app that will save a to do to those locations. Um, dedicated meaning you downloaded some app from a Play Store and it utilizes the existence, for instance, of a music folder. Uh, but as an example, most of the music applications, as an example, the ones that stream music and allow you to also download it, usually will save to their own folder, uh, completely saying, now we don't like the music folder and mess around with basically wherever you have to find those files or wherever you want to find those files, they are never there. But anyway, uh, once you find your files, which like I said, I'm gonna be using some pictures, you want to select it. And you can do this a couple different ways. So number one, uh, if you want to select a single file or just a couple, uh, you can just go and find a file itself, like I have one right here, and hold the first one. You can see it gets checked, and then you can quickly tap on additional ones to select more. Now, if you have, as an example, an entire folder full of photos, like this one, and you want to select everything, you could just kind of select like this and just start checking all, all of them. But honestly, there is an easier way to it, which is just select the entire folder. And that will, that will also select everything that is inside. So whichever we go about selecting the files, it is completely up to you. And it's basically just preference. But once it's selected, on the top on the three dots and choose to either move the files or copy them. Uh, now, depending on which one you choose, it will uh, have a different result. So if you go with a copy, uh, you will basically create uh, duplicates. You will have the original ones where they are right now and new ones and the new location that you will choose to save to. Well, move will completely remove them from where they are right now and move them to a new location. So I'm gonna go with move. Now, once you select one of the two options, uh, no matter which one, you will get this pop-up. So it will ask you where you want to copy or move them to. So you have the internal storage, which is where we are right now, and then the SD card. So I'm gonna just select the SD card. You could move them somewhere else on your phone if you wanted to, but I'm just gonna go with the SD card. Sorry. So once it's open, as you can see, uh, SD card basically has the same folders in here and I can move it into any of those folders that I want to. I can drop it straight in the middle here, or I could also create my own new folder if I wanted to, but I'm just gonna keep it simple and press move here. And as you can see, it's moving or in the progress of moving. And you can see in the background internal storage, DCIM, and you have camera and screenshot and keep, pay attention to it. Camera will disappear from here in a second. Now it looks like there was a little bit more files in there, so it's taking a little bit longer time than I would have expected. And almost done. And there we go. Now as you can see, uh, camera folder just disappeared, which now this folder can be found in the SD card. So camera just now, and as you can see, there is everything inside. 
So that is how you remove any kind of file from one location to another. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching. Thank you.